Like it? Wow. Good morning, Dad. What exactly is going on here? Say hello. Are you Dad? <clears throat> what is going on here? It's my Adobe that is going on here. <clears throat> Dad, I know I have not been good to everyone, including my sister. I have decided to right my wrongs. I hope this sudden change and uh, repentance is not all because I'll be naming a new COO tomorrow. No, Dad, not at all. Look, Dad, whatever the change may be, you're a great king and a great CEO. You know who is fit for the job. Whether it's me or not, whoever you choose is fine by me. Mm. Yes. Well, if this, if this turnaround is a sincere one. I think I would like it. Do have a wonderful day, my princesses. Have a nice day, Dad. Yeah, thank you. Me, I like the new you. Princess. Okay, I don't want some. Please. I have been kidnapped. Oh. I have been kidnapped. I, I need to leave this place. I have been kidnapped. Hey, 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 Kidnapped me. My people are coming. They are coming with the entourage to come and arrest you people. No, we're not kidnappers. If it's not true, listen, I, I am your father, and this is your mother, your biological mother. Do you understand? Are they my biological mother? Yes. Stop believing you people. Leave me alone. I, 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 I will join you. I, I told you before. I used to give somebody your pack or two. I will give you a pack or uh, uh, but That is two. Uh, not now. Not, not today at least. You, you know what? Chisum, what actually happened was that you were involved in an accident and the thing affected your memory. Yes, you had a memory loss. Yes, memory loss. 
was involved in an accident. You were? Yes. Come inside, let me show you pictures. Even when you were younger. Yes. Of course, I am your mother. Can't you recognize my voice? Some, some. Look at the semblance. Yes. Your mother. Some. She looked at me. Some stop. But well, she called me some some. That's it, your name. Yeah, that is your pet name. Chisum. Is it my pet name? Some some. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry, mom. You don't need to bother. Just come. Come she, with she's me. She's my mother. Yes, I am your yes. mother. Just go. <laughs> Nobody said to help her here, okay? Is it <laughs> this is your <laughs> Why weren't you with the princess earlier? Your Majesty, I just went to get water downstairs to give her the medication. Why didn't you send someone to get the water? I'm sorry, Your Majesty. It will never happen again. I do not have to remind you that the princess's health is very delicate. Our memory is no longer what it used to be before. And right now she needs all-round care. Mm. Is that understood? Yes, my king. You may leave. My queen, why, why is your face like this? Is anything the matter? Something I need to know? I thought... I thought she was doing better. She was doing okay these past few days. What changed? My queen, the doctor said the brain organ is a very delicate one and that we should be expecting or experiencing things like this. Even with the drugs? I thought with the help of the drugs, she'll stop forgetting things at least. <sighs> Listen to me, you, you don't have to worry. She's going to be fine. Nonetheless, I, I am going to talk to the doctor, okay? I will. I can't even imagine what she's going through. My baby. Listen, what you should know is that we have a very strong daughter. Have you forgotten? We weren't even thinking that she was going to wake up in the first place. Months later, here we are. All we need to do for her is to be strong for her. Is to have faith. That's all she need, okay? Please, you just have to be strong. Everything is going to be fine. Mm. Dad, what's the meaning of this? Good there, Adobe. How are you? Because I am fine. Oh, please, am I in the mood for your suckers in? Well, this is exactly what it is. Dad, I have been working on this contract, yet to give it to Betty. Let's not talk about the COO that was meant to be mine, yet to give it to Chisum. Even after her accident, you still haven't given me what is mine. You've not given me the job. Listen. Betty has worked for this company for so many years now, and you know it. She was given the contract because she has paid a due diligence. 
so I don't merit it. You treat me like a nobody, yet your favorite daughter gets all of your attention. Adobe, what is it with you and the comparison? Can't you see your younger sister has been going through a lot recently? And I'm not? What do you want me to do before you recognize me as your first child? And whoever told you that I do not know that you are my first daughter? I know that quite all right. But you know I am this man who would never give a thing out because of emotions, except you earn it. You know me. Father, I earn it. And I will not stop until I get what is mine. Adobe, Mom, I don't feel like talking. Please. I heard you arguing with your father. Lately, that's all I do. Listen, you need to give your father a break. He has a lot to deal with. The kingdom, your sister. Here you go again. It's always about Chisom. Oh, come on. She is suffering. And I'm not... Mother, I'm also suffering. I need you to remember that I am you and dad's daughter also. You always cover up for her, even before the accident. I'm sorry if you feel that way. But whatever issues you have with your father, you need to calm down and talk to him. Stop attacking him. That's not the solution. You know what, mom? I'm exhausted. I need to freshen up. Meaning I shall leave? Mom. I'm gone already. Please, do check on your sister. Shama, how are you doing? You remember my name? Of course I remember your name. Is your name not Shama? Yes, my princess. Uh -huh. Why are you surprised? I feel... I feel a lot better today. It's just I just want to leave this room. I'm tired. I just... I feel choked in this room. I want to just go out or something. I don't know. My princess, we can take a stray in the compound. Yes, my princess. Yeah, yes, my princess. Most true. Yes, my princess. Like baby. Yes, my princess. Ah. Let me see. You can go and you can you can go and prepare my bathing water for me. Then bring my makeup kit okay, so that I can get dressed. Okay, we'll do play then. Yes, and um, prepare my things for me. Bring fine gown for me. In this life, I want to be happy. Oh, I don't care what people say about me. Say about me. No time for crutches, cause I know get the clutches. Yeah, all I have is love in my heart. Enemies within could try to weigh me down. Try to weigh me down. But who God bless, no one can curse. Oh, no one. Enemies within could try to weigh me could down. Try to pull me down. But who God bless, no one can curse. All I have is love. Only love. If naya, if naya, all I have is love. Only love. To give you all I have is love. Only love. If naya, if naya. Only love to keep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
My heart is filled with joy and love. No, it's just. Where are you going to? Sorry, my piece, yes, we're just doing our work. You're doing your work. Every day, work, 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 work. Don't you both sit down and rest. I beg, I want to ask you for some questions. How is this kingdom like? The king, is he a good king? Yes, my princess. <laughs> <laughs> eh? So the king is a good king. What about you? Are you a princess? No, we work for you. You are the princess and you have a sister too. You work for me? Yes, ma'am. I'm the princess and I have a sister. Yes, ma'am. Are you my sister? Are you my sister? No, my princess. Are you my sister? No, my princess. Who is not my sister? Your family. You're five. You're five. Uh, five. Yes. Mm. You're ten. Ah. <laughs> 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 you are ten. Three. 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 Wait, wait, wait. We picked you all from the goddess. Clothe you, feed you, house you. What were you supposed to pay us in return? Serve us the basic things. But no. You're here laughing and jesting. I'm sorry, Are you mad? Did I ask you to talk? Why would you slap her? She's my friend. Really? So the maid is now your friend? Yes, she is. Obviously, you wouldn't know nothing because your brain is half dead. Now, listen, all of you. Before I close my eyes and open them, get out! Now! Out! You're just so mean. How dare you talk to her in that manner? What did I say that was not the truth? How dare you talk about that to your father? I saw her mingling with the helps and I stopped her. How did I become a bad person? She was doing good until you aggravated her. That's her business. And how many times have I told you to mind the way you talk when you're around her? Because she is fragile. Dad. I'm not the reason her brain is not working. I didn't cause her accident. Adobe, did you just say that? You are done. You know what? No more allowances for you. Father, you can't do that. I just did. I will talk to you when you're more reasonable. But you have human sympathy. Mom, what? I can't do that. What, what did I say wrong? What did I do? I keep telling you to learn how to talk. Now see! Because I said what's on everybody's mind. Mom, you have to talk to him. Do you know your father? Whatever he say stands. His word is his bond. Do all. Oh, <laughs> 
You did what? You heard me. I don't know what to do. But are you trying to say that our shopping tomorrow is cancelled? Didn't you hear what I just said? You're here talking about shopping. <sighs> See, um, I think your dad is pulling your leg. Why don't you go and apologize to him? He, he, he might reinstate your allowance. Apologizing means I did something wrong. I said what everybody knows. I'm so tired of him pleasing her. So what are you going to do about it? Hello. I know that our kingdom is far bigger and better than theirs in all ramifications of life. But that notwithstanding, we must honor their invitation. You are very correct, Your Majesty. I don't have anything against that. Good. And because I have a whole lot of programs to attend, I am delegating you to represent me on this. That's okay, Your Majesty. I will do just that. So you have to go and start preparing so that you'll get there on time. That's fine, Your Majesty. And let me take my leave. Peace be unto this home. Oh, Richard, my brother, it's uh, my king. You're welcome. Thank you very much. How are you and the family? Oh, we are as good as can ever be expected. Onodugo, my king. My king. You're welcome. My king. Onodugo now. Onodugo now. Onodugo now. Thank you. I was just about to take my leave. Is that so? Yes. That means one of these days I will pay you more costs. That's the problem. <laughs> Your Majesty. All right, that's okay. Have a please. Thank you very much, brother. Richard, to what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Oh, my king, I came in to know how my brother is doing in the running of the kingdom. And to also know how Chisum is faring. Oh, the truth is, some days she's fine. And before you know it, she cannot even recognize anyone. It's as terrible as that. Hmm. This is quite unfortunate. That a fate like that will befall a young girl of her age. Considering the fact that She's blue blood. Royalty. Anyways, I'm pretty sure that she'll come over it. How is Adobe doing? Adobe is a thorn in my flesh. She gets on my nerves on a daily basis. I don't know why she hates her own sister that much. My king. She does not hate her sister. Oh, yes. They are siblings. My king, you know, they, they are bound to have issues. Listen, what I know is that one day, that girl is going to give me a cardiac arrest. Oh, God forbid. My king. You don't say such ill thing about yourself. The great liar, the Onodugo himself, the king of Obinago kingdom. You can never die of cardiac arrest. No, it is not in our lineage. And it can start with you. Oh, yes. We all know, of course, that you will outlive all of us. Eze, Iga Dindu, Ruemwebiebi. He said... Hi. Hi, sis. How are you doing today? I'm fine. What can I do for you? Well, I came to see how you're faring. Um, I'd like you to sign here. It's for the company. What company? Uh, that's company. Just sign it. 
Why am I sending a check? Um, well, your brain cannot comprehend what it's meant for. Just sign. Adobe, I might have lost my full memory, but I'm not stupid. Okay. I... I want to get you some things. Really? Mm -hmm. You might be sick, but you will definitely need some things. Okay, if you're going to take me to shopping, then I'll sign. Good. I really yeah. missed going to shopping. Good. Hey! Hey! Where do you think you're going to? I think she wants me. And? I don't know where she goes. Will you take your stinking seven inside? What insolence! You want to enter into my car as war? Well? Mommy, please. If you utter any word, I will reset your stupid face. She's my sister, I can take care of her. Inside! I want to be happy, oh. I don't care what people say about me. Say about me. No time for crutches, cause I know get the clutches. Yeah, all I have is love in my heart. Yeah. Enemies within will try to weigh me down. Try to weigh me down. But who God bless, no one can curse. Oh, no one. Enemies within will try to weigh me down. Try to pull me down. Who God bless, no one can cause all I have is love. If Naya, all I have is love. To give you all I have is love. If Naya, all I have is love. To give you. My heart is filled with joy and love. I don't get the time to count your sins. I may not know who they do me, but Papa God know who they do me. At the end of the day, joy will come in the morning. Enemies within will try to weigh me down. Try to weigh me down. But who God bless, no one can curse. No one can curse. Yeah. Enemies within will try to weigh me down. Try to pull me down. Who God bless, no one can cause all I have is love. If Naya, Naya, all I have is love. To give you all I have is love. If Naya, Naya, all I have is love. To give. I'm going to the bank. Okay. Keep your eyes on my sister. Your eyes on her. Who is this? My friend, will you give the phone to the owner? What's your problem? What are you doing with his phone? Who is on the line? Who is this? Give the phone to the owner. What do you mean he's not there? Who am I? Who, who is this? Are you mad? Jesus Christ. Are you mad, my friend? She, she didn't get to call on me. It's like there's something wrong with you. I said you should give this phone to the owner. What is your problem? What is? Who is this? Who are you? Bridget! Where is she from? Oh my god. She, she I, thought, was, I, I thought I told you to put your eyes on her. You she, want to put me in trouble? No, 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 no. My father will kill me too. She was in the car. She was... 
Are you out of your mind? I thought I told you to put your eyes on her. She was, she was here. I, what do you mean she was here? I told you specifically, keep your eyes on my sister. My father will kill me today. What kind of... What do I do now? Where, where has she gone to? I know that that is not too sound. Oh my God. Are you all right? You are you all right? Why do you want to jam me? Are you okay? Uh, where where are you going to? I was headed here, but later I head to this place. Now, the lights have changed. Now I don't know where I'm going to. Calm down. Do you know where you are right now, or where you where you're coming from? 
Eh, uh, uh, I cannot remember, but I know I have a father. Oh, oh, all right, that, that's good. Is, is, is that all you can remember? Eh, uh, I don't know. Uh, it, it's all right. We will help you locate your father. Okay? Do you know me? Ah, uh, of course, yes. Uh, did you forget? Relax. Yes, uh, we, 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 we know you, okay? We, we, two of you know me. Yes, we, we, we know you very well. Yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> let's just get out of here first. Okay, okay come. Yeah. Let's go get your father, okay? What do you mean by the princess went out? Why didn't you accompany them? I told Princess Lillian, but she said she can take care of her sister. Did you hear that? Lillian? Lillian? Good evening, Dad. What is good about the evening? Where is your sister? Is she not here? She was supposed to be back home. Can you listen to yourself talk? She said she was coming home alone and you allowed her? Was I supposed to force her to stay? Adobe, what is wrong with you? Why are you so callous? Look, you better pray for your own sake that she is fine, otherwise, you will see the other side of me. What about him? What? what? My kid, excuse me. Do you enjoy your father off or are you just a bad person? I don't know. You tell me since you know me so well. Are you alright? Listen, I will not have you talk to me like that or your father. Your sister is missing because of you. And all we should be doing now is looking for her. Everything is not about you. Silly. Hey, hey. How can I help you? Sorry? How can I help you, gentlemen? Um, please, um, I want to see the king. The king? What for? It has to do with his daughter. The king's daughter? Yeah. Um, okay. Please, make sure they don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Your Majesty, some men are at the gate requesting to see you. One of them said it's about your daughter, the princess. Oh, really? Yes, Please Majesty. let them in. Yes, Your Majesty. My king, what is it? They said some men are at the door wanting to see us because of our daughter. See some? Yes. Oh. Yes, I am not. I am your mother. You are back home. 
Archie Junction. She was actually confused and didn't know where to go to. So my friend here just said we take her to the hospital. But then I saw the royal beads on her and thought I should bring her to the palace. And if she wasn't from here, I would have just taken her to the police station. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. My king, let me take her to her room. It's all right. Oh. So, come. Come with mom. I'm tired. I'm so sorry. Okay. So sorry. Sorry, this way. Thank you very much for bringing her. You're welcome, Your Highness. Easy. Uh, gentlemen, please come and take a seat. Uh, thank you very much. <clears throat> and you are Mr. I'm Kenneth, sir. And Chidi here is my friend. Good day, Your Highness. Oh, once again, you're welcome. I want to thank you. The decision you made to have brought my daughter here is a very wonderful one. I really appreciate it. I want to assure you that whatever you want here is at your beck and call. All you need to do is to say it and you would have it. Oh, thank you very much, Your Majesty. I would like to always come here to check up on her from time to time. I don't have any problem with that. You can come whenever time you are ready. But do you insist you don't want to take anything? We're fine, Your Majesty. You're good. We're good. Man. All right. <laughs> Sometimes I wish Princess Andobi is the one in that condition, not Princess Chisong. My dear, I wish the same. Even in her condition, she's so compassionate and nice. Princess Andobi used to behave as if Princess Chisong is her enemy. I don't know why. That one. She's the other one. But the king likes Princess Chisong more. True. With that attitude. Who will like her? That one, with her mean face, always shouting up and down. Chop, 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 chop. Instead of gossiping, why not do what you are paid for? Eh? What if it was the thing that came in here and saw you? What would you have done? Eh? This should be the last time this happens. This one too, they do over Sabi. Let's go before she will report us. Don't mind her. Adobe Awambo or to an ogre Awaiwa or to an ogre Awato or to an ogre Opposite Ogre Capia Laco. This is an evil adage. What is wrong with you? Your father has been complaining that you go about. Causing trouble. How? Is it because of what happened the other day? It's not my fault that she decided to go home. Oh, will you stop saying that? She is your sister. And you know she's losing memory. So why did she decide on going home? Anyways, that's not why I'm here. <sighs> what is it? Uncle, I need to... Gain my father's respect. I work so hard for that company. Yeah, the thanks I get is him taking my allowance. I'm not some papa on the street. I'm a graduate. I need money to do lots of things. He just cut me off. Anyways, I have heard you, but I must advise that you stop antagonizing people. I do be everyone in this family loves you. I want you to understand that nobody is out to get at you. Understood? Yes, uncle. Uncle, you're the best I've ever had. 
I am your only uncle. I've got your back. Desist from getting yourself into trouble. That is my advice. Anyways, I, I will talk to your father. Uh, thank you, Uncle. Thanks. Hi. Come and join us. Dad, where is she on you? The question should have been, is there any time that she's not hungry? Don't worry about her, just eat your food. I'm waiting for the meat to serve me my food. Mom, tell the meat to give me my food. Some? Mm. Yes, Mom. Your food is in front of you. And you've started eating already. See, there's meat, rice, and salad. Why would you do that? I, I, I felt something in my mouth. I want to confirm if I'm it. I guess I can go towards it. Okay, please, please. Let me mm, put it close to me so I can be seeing it very well. Oh, okay, it's okay. It's, it's nice. Just eat up. can we talk? Talk about what? When are you going to forgive Adobe? And what exactly do you mean by that? Her allowance. She needs money for her upkeep. If Adobe needs the basic things of life, let her go and meet the accountant. Yes. But if you're talking about Adobe spending extravagantly, then forget about it. That's not going to work. It's a no, no. But she's not happy. Have you bothered to ask if I'm happy? If I'm happy the way Adobe is treating our own younger sister? Listen to me. Adobe will not be given her allowances until she turns a new leave. This is an order. Good night. But Greetings, my brother, King Onodogo, the one who single-handedly transformed Opinago Kingdom to the enviable height we enjoy today. I greet you, brother. You can say that again. You're welcome, my brother. Please. Thank you. Ah. So, what brings you here today? Uh, well, my king, I decided to come and see how the royal household is doing and um, talk about something. Oh, that's so thoughtful of you. That's all right. I'm all ears. <clears throat> my king, it is about Adobe. She's very sorry for whatsoever she has done. You know what? You always spoil Adobe. 
What stops her from coming to apologize to me in person? Uh, my king, I actually asked her to wait until I speak to you first. Listen, it is not just about what she did to her sister. Her behavior generally to everyone is a problem. Adobe is reckless. And I wonder what will become of the COO project if I eventually give it to her. Oh. You're thinking about giving it to her? Yes. But her behavior is giving me a concern. <laughs> My king. You know, you can never expect total decorum from a baby when suddenly you pull the nipples out of his mouth while sucking. Yes, I, I want my king to consider reinstating her allowances. I believe that will bring about the change you seek. Well, enough of Adobe. I'll think about that later. Um, are you in the mood for any drink? Oh, always, always. <laughs> you know your brother. <laughs> God. You are the only one that keeps crossing my mind. You are the only one for me. I've been loving you since yesterday, and I want to do it again. Hello. Good day, princess. Wow. So handsome and respectful. It's hard to find out these days. My dad is not around. Did the guards tell you? Well, I'm not here to see the king. The queen? No. Oh, you're here to see me. I should have known that. Okay, I was going out. You care to join me? Well, I'm here to see Princess Chisum, and not you. Are you aware her brain is half dead? I mean, her brain is not working. Anyways, suit yourself. So, that time you asked my family, if you go back again, you will all eat again. Hello. You best see so that the area will be cool. Princess Sisson, how are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Get. Uh, who are you? You can't remember who I am. I don't know you. Ah, it's, it's all right. I I actually brought this for you. Hmm? Thank you. You're welcome. So how have you been? Fine. Ah, um, of course you're fine. I can see that. Huh? Oh. Yeah. Um. Shoma. Yes, my princess. What are you holding? My princess, your pistol got you a gift. My visitor. Yes, my princess. Who is my visitor? Uh, me. She's... I got this for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, but... Are you collecting gifts from him? Today is not my birthday now. Or did I forget? No, my princess. Eh? Yes, my princess. Did you say you know him? Yes, my princess. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I... We know you. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Ah. <sighs> so, I... I actually got that for you. I should be on my way back to the office. No, let's walk around the compound. Since we know you. Choma, shall you say you know him? Yes, my princess. Let's go. We know you. All right, all yes. right. Walk around. In this life, I want to be happier. I don't care what people say about me. Say about me. No time for crutches. Cause I know get the clutches, yeah. All I have is love in my heart. Yeah. 
enemies we did go try to weigh me down. try to weigh me down oh god bless no one can come oh, no one enemies we did go try to weigh me go down try to pull me down oh god bless no one can cause all i have is love, Only love. if from now ya now ya all i have is love, Only love. to give you My heart is filled with joy and love I know get the time to count your sins I may not know who they do me But Papa God know who they do me At the end of the day, joy will come in the morning Enemies within go try to weigh me down. Try to weigh me down But who God bless, no one can cause No one can cause, yeah Enemies within go try to weigh me down Try to pull me down But who God bless, no one can cause All I have is love Only love If from now ya, now ya All I have Can't see. is love Have you seen that fire man always come to this place? Yes, you. the most amazing things They always come here for Princess Chiso it makes me happy. At least one good thing is working for Princess Chiso. She has suffered a lot. Oh, that Princess Adobe is always shouting. Imagine, that farmer is coming for someone with memory loss. But Princess Adobe does not have anyone. I What time? Okay. I have to check my schedule then to get back to you. No problem. Let me call you back. Mom, I need to talk to you. What is it? How old do you know this Kenneth guy? Oh, Kenneth, the handsome guy. He's been nice to your sister. <laughs> I see. Clearly, he has used his charms to blind you all. What are you talking about? Do you ever think he's sweet talking your daughter because she's half brain and vulnerable? Adobe! How many times have I warned you to stop calling her that? He's a gold digger who wants to marry a princess and gets everything that comes with it. Because how else can a person be nice to someone who forgets per second? Think about it, mother. Coming now, my man. Ah, so my face is like this. What's the problem, man? Ah, uh, man. Uh, I just can't get her off my mind, man. Ah, uh, is it about the princess? Oh yeah, man. I, I feel for her. Man. I mean, a beautiful girl in that condition. I wonder how she copes. Man, she's indeed a beautiful girl, bro. But. Do you actually know what the problem is with her? No idea at all, bro. Shoot now, man. This is your, this is your expertise, bro. Oh, this is your expertise, bro. Uh, you, you're right. I... I don't know. I'll... Uh, I'll find out. I need to do something about that. Never be less, bro. I am so tired. The meeting today was extremely tiring, man. Oh, yeah. I can't. <laughs> So how do we to go? Any yeah. conclusions? Yeah, my brother, just give me something to drink, man. I need a drink. 
So it's okay. All right, I'll get you something right away. Soft here? Yeah, anything, anything hot, can Anything <laughs> Something hard. You are hot. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much, Your Highness. May we know who's Kenneth? My name is Dr. Kenneth Ebuogo. I'm from this village. I studied medicine and surgery abroad and I decided to come back here to help my people. I just completed a massive hospital here to that effect. And I'm single. Oh, my nice profile. Oh, thank you very much. Dr. Kenneth, I am glad you came back home to offer your experience. I mean, things like this are not easy to come by. I know. And that brings me to your daughter's condition. So for how long has she been forgetting things? My daughter was in an accident and then she had amnesia. According to the doctor, with our medications and time, she may or may not get back her memories. It's a 50-50 team. And a month later, she started forgetting new memories. Sometimes for days, other times for even weeks. I'd like to take a look at her medical report. I want to have a brief of a medical history. Um, there won't be any for that. Uh, we have competent doctors who are already on her case, so you don't need to worry. Stay, let's do lunch. Uh, no, ma'am. I need to go back to the hospital. I have a lot to take care of there. Oh, yes. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. I wish you to take my leave. Sure. So welcome, Dr. Kenneth. Thank you. Mm. My queen, yes. what he just said was exactly what I found out. And I know that you are going to feel better now that you know. I still do not believe what I heard. Honey? Honey, who was that? Oh, nobody. That boy is a good boy. Stop looking for what is not there. Let's go to bed. Come to bed. How did you find my office? So many questions. Which do you answer first? About knowing this place. It's nothing. What can I do for you? So, I heard you're no longer a gold digger. You're a gold owner. You are loaded. So I have one question that's getting me all confused. 
But what can that question be? Why a single, handsome, rich, obviously smart gentleman likes a half wit like my sister? Why do you talk so bad about your sister? Because I'm saying the truth. Listen, instead of wasting time on my sister who will never remember you, why don't I make you feel good? At least give you a taste of what she can never give you. <laughs> What kind of sister are you? I asked her the question. What kind of sister are you? Now pick your bag and get the hell out of my office now. Get out. Don't say I didn't warn you. Just get out. Adobe. 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 What is it? What are you thinking? Nothing. I was just... It's nothing. Okay. So you were saying that um, Kenneth guy threw you out of his office? He's just been stubborn. Don't worry. I'll deal with him. I know how to get him. It's obvious he likes your sister. She will not get this one. She already has everyone bowing at her feet. She won't have this one. I will not let it happen. Okay, so what are you going to do about it? I'm going to report her. To who? The king? Yes. What would that solve? <sighs> You're right, it's not going to solve anything. What do you advise I do? Think you should just avoid her. Just avoid her totally. Avoid her? How in God's name am I supposed to avoid her when she already knows my office? I know a lot of them, women like that, man. They can only talk, 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 and do nothing. Don't worry your head about it, brother. Sister-in-law, her majesty. Greetings. Oh, please. Drop the pretense. Say what you want. 
I am here to see my brother. Leave my family alone. I beg you with everything you hold there, go and disturb someone else. Please! You see that? He is my family. My blood. And besides, I don't take orders from you. You good? You like the wine, Abu? Oh yes, I do. It's um, actually a very nice one. Um, it's me that bring it. I chose it. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's a nice brand. Wow. First time take medication, my princess. Every time medication, medication. I'm so sorry, my princess. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry about that. So sorry, my princess. What happened? Is it me that fall it? No. I'm sorry. It's, I'm it's... sorry. I'm very sorry if I fall it. I'm sorry. No, it was actually a mistake, okay? Not for me. Okay, it's not me that fall it. No, no, no. Ha. Not you. Okay? Thank God. You know, any small thing they say is me that caused it. Uh, That's why. Ah, right, go ahead. It wasn't you. It was me. It's fine, okay? You two you are fine, okay? Go ahead. you ask questions you already have the answers to. I'm here to see you, darling. And I made it clear to you that I'm not interested. As you can see, I was on my way out. Okay. Have a nice day. I'll just stay back. Do you have food? Are you dumb? I said I'm going out. That means you have to leave my house now. Get out. Out. I know your type. You pretend to say no until you eventually give in. You like the chase? Don't worry. I'll keep chasing you till you say yes. Have a nice day, my love. Just get out. Hello, Mr. Kennett. Good afternoon, Your Majesty. How are you? I am fine, Your Majesty. Um, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. Ah, oh, please, come to the palace. I think I still have some time before the council meeting. Uh, I'm sorry, Your Majesty, it's something very sensitive. I'd like to talk to you alone. Okay. I, I'll be having a meeting in the office. I don't know when it will end, but whenever I have time, I'll come and see you. Right, thank you very much, Your Majesty. You're welcome. That doctor is proving to be too stubborn. Who rejects this body? What does he say in that handicap? A bloody half brain. I won't stay here and watch her enjoy everything meant for me. No.
You like it? Mm. Wow. Good morning, Dad. What exactly is going on here? Say hello. How are you, Dad? Mm. What is going on here? It's me and Adobe that is going on here. Dad, I know I have not been good to everyone, including my sister. I have decided to right my wrongs. I hope this sudden change and uh, repentance is not all because I'll be naming a new COO tomorrow. No, Dad, not at all. Look, Dad, whatever the change may be, you are a great king and a great CEO. You know who is fit for the job. Whether it's me or not, whoever you choose is fine by me. Mm. Yes. Well, if this, if this turnaround is a sincere one, I think I would like it. Do have a wonderful day, my princesses. Have a nice day, Dad. Thank you. Me, I like the new you. Princess. You're welcome, you must. Thank you, Doctor. What is it you want to discuss with me that I had to make a trip to your office? Someone is actually doing this to Chisum. Doing what exactly? I do not trust anyone in the palace. That's why I asked you to come. I don't understand what you're talking about. And please do not waste my time because I'm a very busy man. All right. You said she had a traumatic brain injury which caused her amnesia. Yes. From what you said, she had what we call a retrograde amnesia, which is the loss of memory formed before the actual brain injury. Yes. Not. The loss of memory may come back or may not. But my problem here is why she loses memory every time, even when she's still on medications. But I told you the doctor said this could happen. Oh yes, but not by this, you must. Now, the other day I visited her. One of the maids tried to administer her pills to her, and somehow she threw some on the floor. I'm so sorry, my princess. Oh. I'm so sorry. I'm so um, sorry, my princess. No, no, don't, don't worry about those. Just... Let's cut the rest, okay? I'm so sorry, my princess. What happened? Is it me that fall it? No. I'm sorry. It's I'm sorry. I'm very sorry if I fall it. I'm sorry. No, it was actually a mistake, okay? Not for me. Okay, it's not me that fall it. No, no, no. Ha. Not you. Okay? Thank God. You know, any small thing they say is me that caused it too. That's why. Ah, right, go ahead. I picked it. And I tested it. And what happened? It was not the actual drug. It was only put in the right container to make it look like the right drug. The drug is responsible for a loss of memory coupled with the amnesia. The drug is a no-brainer. What? Your Majesty, do you know anyone who could be responsible for this? Someone who could um, switch her drugs? Shouting. Where 
is that stupid daughter of yours. Good for nothing daughter of yours. I know what she's done. Dad! Dad, how was the meeting? Are they gonna make me the COO? That is what you always care about. At the expense of your sister's health. What kind of a human being are you? And who are you? Dad, what are you talking about? What do you mean? Kadobi, why do you hate your sister so much? <laughs> do you want her to wallow in, in, in abject penury? Mommy, what has she done? Tell us, what is going on? Listen to me. You will leave this palace and never come back here again. Why? Henceforth, you are no longer my princess or my daughter. Have I made myself clear? Out of my way. Get out of my way! Since. Mom, I... I don't know what dad is talking about. I don't want to leave this place. Please. Help me talk to dad. Please. What oh. is it? What is it? My king, what did she do? Adobe is poisoning Chisom, making her sick. What? Who told you that? I am just returning from Dr. Kenneth's office. Chisom has been taking drugs that is making her forget everything instead of getting better. Adobe is so jealous that she had to change the drugs. Can you beat it? How do you know it's Adobe? Then who? Who did? Excuse me. This is not Choma. 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 Please, my queen. Have you seen anyone go close to Princess's drugs? My queen, I'm the only one that goes near the drugs. Meaning that you are the one that switched her drugs. No, my queen. I can never do such a thing. Princess Chisom is a good person. Now listen. Go pack your things. You don't walk in here. Please, my queen. Please, my queen. I didn't do it. Even if you didn't. Please, my queen. It's your fault. You were in charge. Please, my queen. You're lucky I didn't call the police please, on me. Now get out! So I think. Oh, please. Talk to my daddy for me. I won't. Adobe, I won't. I want you. I want you to be of your best behavior until the COO job is given to you. But you are impatient. I didn't do anything. Oh, will you stop that? You think I will succumb to this emotional blackmail again? Never. But I didn't do it. I don't even know what he's accusing me of. Uncle, I know I've been a bad daughter and a sister. Please forgive me. I don't want to be homeless. I 
Adobe. Hmm. Adobe. Hmm. Adobe. Hmm. How many times did I say this? Three good times. It's all right. I will talk to your father, my brother, to find out at least what is going on. But you have to lay low and don't ever cause further mischief. Have I made myself clear? Yes, Uncle. Uncle, thank you. Okay. I don't know how I don't know how a sister can be so heartless even to her own blood. Same question I keep asking myself. I mean, what is she going to gain doing that to her own blood? My brother, your enemies are never the problem. Betrayal doesn't come from your enemies. But you see the loved ones, they won't just betray. They can kill. You're so correct, bro. You have to write. So, guy, what are you going to do about it? Uh, first things first. She has to get better first, and I will see to that. Yeah. Come on. We'll see. Your Majesties, I brought some new medications for Chisum and also a standby nurse to always stand to her. Dr. Kenneth, thank you so very much. You've done enough already to help my daughter. I sincerely appreciate. Chisum is my very good friend. She has suffered enough. And I think it's time for her to heal. Oh, yes. Yes. I um I'll be coming from time to time for routine checkup. Dr. Kenneth, my house is your house. Come in anytime, any day. Do whatever you can to help her. Um, right, let me take the nurse to Chisong's room. It's if right. you wouldn't mind. Oh, please do. Uh nurse? Come with me. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Your Majesty. Doctor. Thank you very much. Mother, how are you? I'm not fine. Did you discuss with Dad? He doesn't want to see you. What did I do? He said you were changing your sister's drug. Something to make her forget things more and more. Is it true? I know I hated my sister, but I didn't do it. You don't believe me? Oh, I'll talk to your father. I'll try to persuade him. I'll beg him not to disown you. How's Bridget? She's been so good to me, taking me in. Why did you ask me to meet you here? To avoid traces. I asked your uncle to invite you over. I just want to see you. I transferred five million naira to your account. Please. Take care of yourself. 
for the time being. I'll be keeping in touch. Is it not too late? I know it's too late. I'm wondering how you could be sleeping so peacefully like a newborn when your daughter is out there in the dark. My daughter is sleeping right now as we speak. So what are you talking about? I don't believe they do it. And I believe her. Okay. If Adobe didn't do it, then who did? Sure, ma. The same girl you sucked and could not allow me to interrogate? I questioned her and I know she did it. That's why I sent her parking. Stop punishing Adobe. Make her come back to the house. Adobe did it. No. Whether you like it or not, there is nothing you can tell me about that. It's up to you to believe it or not. Listen, I have a very important meeting tomorrow morning. I need to sleep. Good night. Don't wake me up again. You see this time I have to wake you up. See, we, we need to talk about this. My daughter has to come home. What is it? Traveling. I think uh, by the end of next month. Are we going with the children? No, this time it's for only you and I. Mm -hmm. We're going to the Caribbean Good morning, Islands. Your Highness. Good morning, Your Majesty. Yes. Good morning, Your Majesty. There is something about you this morning. <laughs> you all glow, radiating beauty coming. My king, she has really, really improved. She didn't even need a reminder today. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. Princess, it's so nice to see you like this today. Thank you, Dad. You're welcome. Mom, are you all right? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I'm just happy for you. <laughs> yeah. I'm hungry. What's for breakfast? On ripe plantain with fresh fish. Oh, yes. Something very special for you. <laughs> 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 oh, 
But what I'm seeing right now, see, it's a miracle. There's a lot of improvement. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Thank God. All thanks to you. No, no. All thanks to God. We're nothing but mere instruments used by God to heal. Indeed. Yeah. Um, Ken? Yes? Will I ever recover my memory before the accident? Of course. Uh, at least medically, you have to prepare yourself to, to heal. And spiritually, you need to have faith and pray fervently. Trust me, miracles are bound to happen. Thank you so much, Ken. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming into my life when I didn't know I needed someone the most. And thank you for not giving up on me. Thank you for loving me. And above all, thank you for always talking to me about God. Trust me, I'll do that again and again and again. Because I love you so much. Huh? I love you too. <laughs> so I'll continue with the drugs, right? Oh yes, you have to continue with drugs, I give to you. Yeah. And I also write out some more drugs I'm giving to you, okay, by the pharmacy. Okay. You'll be fine. <laughs> I'm glad. Huh? <laughs> so can we go out for lunch? Of yes. course, we will. We will. Huh? We have done. Um, I'll just don't worry. I'll. Um... Dad. Yes, princess. I want to ask you for your favor. I hope it has nothing to do with that girl. Daddy, you have punished her enough. Please, allow her to come back. No, no, no. And I do not want her to come close to you either. Dad, hatred makes you small, but forgiveness gives you the room to grow. You need to forgive her for yourself to free your soul and your spirit. You know what? I am going to think about this because you have said so. You think about it. Thank you so much, Daddy. Thank you. Not up here, do you? I know, Daddy. What does it? It's in the past now. My princess, Your Majesty, lunch is ready. Thank you, Choma. I see. You brought Choma back. Yes, Dad. I know Choma did not change my meds. I know that too. Your sister did. Dad. Mm hmm. You remembered me? No. My father used to. Greetings, sir. Greetings, my presence. My, my dad is saying a lot of things about you. He's always talking about you. That's why I remember you. I, uh, I think I know you. I know you! I know you! 
Ang ano yun? What did you say you want to see? I want to know if your father is inside. My father? Yes. My father is in his chambers. Come, sure you want to go and see my father? I have come in. Let me go and tell my father that a stranger is here to see him. Let's go. Oh. Oh. Why are you always visiting here? What is your problem? What do you want? Your Majesty, I've warned you. I don't take orders from you. What do you want from me? Listen, you made me a promise. We need to talk. What promise are you talking about? Let's see. You made me a promise that you stay away from this home. Oh, woman, stop that. What you can stop me from visiting my brother. Please go somewhere else. Do you want to expose us? Expose us? What do you mean? What about the secret? Oh, stop that. I don't want you talking that way. What do you want me to stop? Hey, Rich, I'm man. not. <laughs> What about the secret? Oh, stop that. I don't want you talking that way. What do you want me to stop? I remember. Uncle here is the reason for my so-called accident. I remember. What? What do you want me to tell him, Richard? I want you to speak up. Adobe is our daughter. And she deserves a stake in the family's company since my brother fired me. I, I will tell him. But please, stop pushing. If he finds out the truth, it will kill him. Oh, yeah, of course, you know, I'm not going to let the cat out of the bag. But the way and manner he behaves towards her is quite unfortunate. Because it's quite she unfair. cares about herself. Only herself, but no one else. Talk to her. She listens to you. Just make sure you speak to him. Anyways, when when next are we meeting? <laughs> yes. I beg your pardon. But I mean, why don't you just shut your mouth up? I told you we are done. Now listen, stay away from us. I cannot stop enjoying you. You're so you shut up. I don't want to. Sh just shut your mouth. Oh, tell me. <laughs> Why what? Why what, baby girl? Don't baby girl me, mother. I was expecting you to say, no, I did not cheat on my husband. Why did you do it? Shh, you bring, bring down your voice. Where did you hear that? Mom. See. 
I am sorry. It was a time in my life I regret. Oh, Chisun, please. Don't tell anyone. N not even your father. Please. You are asking the princess of this land to keep a secret from the king? Yes. For my sake. Mother, I will not do it. I'm giving you three days, three days to confess your sins to my father. Let him know that you cheated on him with his own brother. Not only that, you have a love child who happens to be my sister together. Fail not to do that, mother. I promise you, I will tell him the truth. Chisel, chisel. Oh my word. Oh my word. I'm so sorry. That was a trying period for me, and we're always at loggerhead. Quarreling all the time. I find solace in your brother. So the laughs and judgment and before before I could say anything, I, I found out I was pregnant with that dopey. I couldn't get myself to tell you because it's a terrible thing. I I I thought I I trusted you. You and my brother did this to me? Richard. Brother Albert. I I hated you then. Yes. You had everything going for you. The throne was added to it. I lost my wife. To me, it seemed my life had come to an end. I became so envious of you to the point that I, I don't know what came over me. And I, I had your, your wife. We did not continue after the birth of Adobe, though. But when she called to inform me that Chisum is now aware of what transpired between me and her, there and then I decided to do something. Hello. 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 Uh, Beatrice, what is it? Chisum knows about us. She knows that Adobe is our daughter. How? Yes, I am trying to talk to her, but she's trying to tell the king. You know what that means? We, we are in trouble. Threatening to tell the king? <laughs> uh, 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 Beatrice, calm down. I will personally handle this, okay? I will handle this. What? You? Okay. I'm trying to become. All right. Okay. Just so. Um... You asked for us to see. Let's talk. So I'm here. Um. So, I 
will start by saying thank you very much for hearing my call. Uh, please, this issue is not something your father must know about. Please, I, I don't want you to tell your father about this. You know me, your uncle, I'm a good person. Do you mean I shouldn't tell my father about Adobe or the affair you have with my mother? Yeah, sure. sure. Seriously, I'm sorry. I need to inform my father that you, his brother, and his wife are not people he can trust. Some, 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 please. Please, you, you can't do this to me. You... Okay, I'm sorry for touching you, but, but some, you know I loved you. Right from kindergarten, there is nothing you ever asked me to do for you that I did not do. So believe me, that was a mistake. And if it's not even as if we continued, we never continued. We ended it there. And, and please, that is the reason I called you. So that we can talk face to face, dialogue. You understand me? Because I know I'm a good man. You know I am a good man. Think... Uh, please don't tell your father about this. Please. Please. I, I think coming here was a mistake. Like I told your fellow adulterer, I'm giving you two, two days, two days to tell my father, the king, about your affair with my mother and her batter Dobi, his daughter. Failure to do so, I will tell him myself. Take care. Come back here. Ah! So, 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 God. Richard, so you did this to my, my, my daughter? Brother, please, I beg you, it wasn't intentional. I had no intentions of hurting her. But when it happened, I had no other choice than to take her to the hospital. And I lied that she was involved in an accident. Please. Forgive me. <laughs> Truly, I had the intention of telling you the truth. But when I heard that she had amnesia, I decided to keep it to myself. I'm very sorry, brother. Please. Three of you did this to my daughter. And as though the amnesia is not enough, you sent your daughter to give her drugs so she could forget things. What kind of a woman are you? Adobe is innocent. I've been the one switching the medication. You? Mom, why? Why would you do such a thing to me? I was so focused on keeping the secret. So when the doctor said that she, she might recover her memories, I became so, so, so scared. I just want her to forget. So I got the drugs. And ever since then, I have been switching them. What, 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 what kind of family is this? I'm so sorry. Please. Yeah. So all along I've been living with total strangers. But you know what? <laughs> I am assuring you that none of you will go unpunished. Please. In please. fact, let me call the commissioner of police. Please, 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 please my please, brother. Please. Remember, please, you are only surviving brother. I don't want my... Life. I want to be happy, oh. I don't care what people say about, me. say about me. No time for crutches, cause I know get the clutches, yeah. All I have is love in my heart. Yeah. Enemies within could try to weigh me, down. try to weigh me down. But who can bless? No one can come. 
is redeemed Go try to wear me down What do you want? I came to see my big sister. I heard you have sisters now. It doesn't matter. You are still my sister. I want you to come back home. Well, my uncle, or should I say dad, banished me. I can't come. Adobe, you just need to swallow your pride. Come back and apologize to dad. I guess I was a pain in the ass. Yes, a very big pain in the ass, sincerely. That's okay. I'm sorry for hating you and trying to take everything from you. I'm sorry. It's okay. Dad, I know sorry won't fix anything. But that's the only word that can convey how I feel. I know I haven't been an easy child to love and I've caused you so much pain. Please, forgive my wrongdoings. I only wanted you to notice me. So I am sorry too. I I did not do well as a father. I've always felt that since you're the oldest, you would take care of yourself while I give all the attention to your younger sister. But now I know better. I know that I should have shown you both equal love. So I want to say I am very sorry too. I forgive you. Thank you, Father. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome back to the palace. And I want to make you a promise here and now that henceforth, things are going to turn around for better in this palace, for good here in the palace. And I am starting that by handing you over the CEO of the company. Oh my God. Oh yes. Oh my God. But I thank you. Thank you, my God. But I thank you. Thank you. Just oh, thank you. Oh, thank you for making this happen. I'm so sorry for everything. But I thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy all this is over. Welcome home, boss. <laughs> I think this calls for a celebration. <laughs> Please, listen to what I have to tell you. I do not want to listen to whatever you have to tell me. Turn around and leave this place now. Kenneth, please. I beg you. Please. All right. I'm listening. What do you have to tell me? I'm here to apologize for everything I did to you. I developed hatred for my sister Chisholm, and that includes you. But I realized my mistake and I know I'm wrong. And I'm here to say I'm sorry. Well, thank you very much for apologizing. And I forgive you. Kenneth. Yes. I see how you've been there for my sister. It's difficult these days to find men who are loyal to the one they love. It's so refreshing. And I'm rooting 
for the both of you. You deserve each other. Well, thank you very much. Thanks for accepting my apology. I see you were busy before I walked in. I will leave you to do your work. Thank you very much. Have a nice day, Mr. Kennings. You too. very trying time. But you mesmerized me with your beauty, your fragility, your innocence and essence. And just there and then, I knew you are my soulmate. And so right here, before God and before you, I promise to always be there for you in times of need. To always share with you life, joyous moments. To lavish you with all the love I can muster. Chisu. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Will you marry me, Chiso? Be my wife. The mother of my own born kids. Please. I... I... I thank God for bringing you into my life. I don't know what I would have done without you. Yes, I'll marry you. <laughs> <laughs> this is so beautiful. You like Even it? my that size, I love it. <laughs> I'm glad you love it. Thank you. <laughs> No, again, we have to let everything be the way it is. That's right. It has to be like that. <laughs> hey, Daddy. Daddy, I'm. I'm Greetings, Your Majesty. This is a no I'm sorry. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. It's okay. Uh, Kenneth, you're welcome. Uh, oh, no, we're done with this. Okay, thank you. Uh, Princess? Yes, Daddy. What is it? Is there something you want to tell me? I'm engaged. Wow, wow. <laughs> this is good news. Thank yes, you, baby. May this good news bring both of you happiness in this kingdom. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you've done noble. I think this is a cause for celebration. Oh, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Daddy. What is it? Is there anything you want to do? Yes, there's something I want to beg you for. Alright, say it. I'm all ears. I want you to bring mommy back home. Oh, no, no, no. Your mother is in jail already, and that is where she ought to be. Daddy, please. Just grant my own wish, please. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. You know what? I am. Um, Going to think about it. That is all I can give you for now. Thank you. 
Thank you, Daddy. I know you're going to do it. <laughs> Until then. Um, now, shall we continue the celebration? Oh, yes, ma'am. Guys! <laughs> To be happy, oh. I don't care what people say about me. Say about me. No time for crutches, cause I know get the clutches. Yeah, all I have is love in my heart. Yeah. Enemies within could try to weigh me, down. try to weigh me down. But who God bless, no one can cut. Oh, no one. Enemies within could try to weigh me or try down. To The time to count your sins. I may not know who they do me, but Papa God know who they do me. At the end of the day, joy will come in the morning. Enemies within could try to weigh me, try to weigh me down. But who God bless, no one can curse. No one can curse. Yeah. Enemies within could try to weigh me down. Try